Welcome to Convos in the Attic, short conversations among friends about the simplest of things, backed up by the deepest of thoughts, all done in an attic. I'm Albert, so we'll start it off this year with Let's introduce yourself, bro. Oh, I'm Fons. <laughs> and we and have a special guest today. <laughs> the very the first guest of Convos in the Attic 2020. Yes, sir. Oh my god. We got our good friend, Miss Bea Lobaton. Oh my god. Hi, Bea. AKA Hi guys. Bea Margarita. Bay the Bay Lobaton. I'm here finally. Hi, Hi guys. Lo. Thanks yes. for having me. I mean, we're fucking grateful. Uh, fun here. fact, si Bea yung first <laughs> fun fact. guest na guest. may alam about this podcast. Technically, you could say that. Yeah. Back, back in 2016. You want to share that little story? Oh. Na, okay na Basta alam na na <laughs> Let's just say, they believed us when no one did. <laughs> oh, that's for sure. That's for sure. That's for sure. But yeah, so, well, welcome. Here we are now. Thank you. Thank yes. you for having me. So, Fonzie, are we good? Mm-hmm. We start things off. With a banger, with a good ass question, because something just happened, like a recent event, right? It's event, but yeah, I mean, it is technically two right? days ago. Yeah, I mean, just a few days ago we had Valentine's. Yes. It was the season of loving. It's still the season of loving. Every day is a should wow, be day of loving. Every day, okay. But yeah, we no, just we just had Valentine's. How was that for y'all? How hmm. about you, Fancy? <laughs> you first. Uh, wala, ako, I didn't celebrate. Why? How pero, do you mean? You're not for it? Yeah, parang walang roses, walang cards, walang anything. Yeah, why you just you guys like out. that? <laughs> you cold-blooded, son. <laughs> diba? I mean, what? sa akin kasi, if you're with someone, you don't have to celebrate it. Ooh. Pero no, if you want to, true. you can. Pero wala lang. Parang I feel like every day is like, You know, I'm grateful. Technically, I mean, every case, day right? should be like Valentine's Day for couples. Mm-hmm. Yes, ideally, so, that should yeah. be the goal for us. Yeah, hindi yung one day in a year ka lang nag-exert ng extra effort Ooh, just to show someone preach. you love them, Okay, you bae. Know? Yes. You know? I think th- there's a source of like, um, from bae with this topic. Well, right? How did you spend your Valentine's? Me? Yeah, oh, you um, my Valentine's this year was, I was just at work. All day, mm. and I actually had dinner at home with family. That oh, that was just my Valentine's. Uh, it was it was no, it was good because I didn't know that we had plans for the family, but it was good because I mean you know like what I said earlier, Valentine's doesn't just have to be about love between two partners. You know, it has Facts. can be with friends, family. Definitely. So Indeed, that's but, what I had. The very traditional Valentine's is about. Love between two people who are couples. Yeah, yeah. Pero traditionally, traditionally, I, I suppose you could yeah. say that. But at the same time, like, yeah, I'm with what Bay's saying too. Like at the end of the day, you want to celebrate love, right? Love in general. Yeah. yeah. But so, that should be every day, nga. Yeah, definitely, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> I suppose it's like a heightened thing. No, I guess it's a glorified it. thing. Baka, it's a glorified baka thing. that's also why Fonz was saying na he doesn't really believe in Valentine's Day because I know other guys also who feel the same way and. Some girls did. Na parang, for example, my boss. Yeah. I I, I have a teammate at work. Uh, na nagdala ng bouquet to the office. Bigay ng husband niya. So and mm. then our boss saw it and then she was like, "Oh, I told my husband, don't buy me flowers because they're a waste of money." Well, there technic- you go. Technically, it is. There I mean, you it's go. a nice gesture. It but is. you can also show or express your love in other forms. Someone maybe for someone who's practical. Na like you That's don't have real. to spend. That's on real. flowers maybe Pero, something like groceries maybe what if oh that's your love God. language I mean sheesh I'm, I'm a diba? that that's your love that language, language. Yeah. exactly Pero, mo, in terms of practicality nga kung together na kayo for a long time you don't need to buy roses bilan mo ng hydro flask you know Give, yeah, give, something give that, that would be more useful something nice I mean it depends yeah. right if your partner wants fucking flowers, flowers I mean sheesh yeah. gotta deliver some of those but I Yes. Yeah, right? I, <laughs> I mean, I, it makes me curious yes, though because I I also want to try to take your 
point on that. For example, for Fonz, who let's say says na he doesn't really believe in Valentine's and giving flowers, what if the person you are with mm. would ha- has expressed to you that oh I would love to receive flowers on Valentine's Ooh. Day. So who 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 sacrifices for who? You know what? I mm. was actually just talking about this with a friend, close friend of ours. Hi kids. Yeah, the other day. Yeah. Kids? But uh, basically the whole gist of the yeah, Kit Kat Legata. But yeah. Um basically the whole conversation was about say who would like exert effort between the two in a way. Yeah. Like say would it be n- like yeah, at the end of the day it's a mutual relationship, but for the most part it seems like traditionally boys like, tend yeah. to like be the one to my, do sab- shit. My, one mm-hmm. of my office mates said nga na sabi do, yung same office mate who brought the bouquet sabi do sa kanya ng asawa niya bago siya began was that just so you know Valentine's can also be for guys which is techni- hell yeah technically hell yes yeah. it can also be for guys but it's for yun, yeah it's just traditionally it yeah yeah traditionally. but yeah like for the most part right I mean yeah wait ano yung question mo kanina yung which one? Like, yung flowers? Ah, ayun, so, yun nga. So, sino, mag, sino mag-adjust? If ikaw ay mo magbigay, tinanong, tapos yung it, girlfriend mo, sabi niya, gusto niyang makatanggap. So, sino? May magbibigay pa? Or merong I mean, hindi I, I have an answer for that. Okay. Ah, so, for me, nagmamatter, lal, mas nagmamatter kung gano'n kayo katagal together. How long have you guys been dating? Mm-hmm. If you guys are together, yun lang. <laughs> Wait, no, did, you, no, did he no, 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 listen. I was like, Wait, yeah. no, yeah. we were listening, bro. <laughs> no, 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 I hear you. No, we're good, we're good, we're good. But yeah, I hear you. It doesn't matter because if sa akin, kung matagal na kami ng girl, let me finish. Kasi. <laughs> kung matagal na kami yung, ng girl, I would be conf- com- more comfortable saying na you don't I, don't, give. I, I don't wanna give you flowers. Wait, you tell the girl straight up? Hindi, hindi naman. Pero, alam mo yun, parang you don't have to. The first, pero, I, the first Valentine's you spent before, nagbigay ka ba? Yes. That's yeah. my point. Kasi, yeah. it matters if matagal na kayo. But Not also, really, there's this pero, idea attached to it. I feel like na... Oh, so yung effort na sa simula. No, it's it's lang. not about the flowers. It's <laughs> about oh, the that's thought. That's some real shit though. Yeah. That's some real shit though. No, no it's about the thought eh. If you want to give your girl fra- flowers, then give your girl flowers. Kung di mo type, di mo magawin. Kasi it's the thought that counts. It's not the flowers that counts. Kung gusto mo bigyan siya ng gift, then that's kesa yeah. flowers. And that's what's more so meaningful short, for you both. So in short, hindi I give flowers kung gusto ng girl. Pero kung may more practical gift siya na gusto or some shit. Yeah, I hear yeah, you. Yeah, I suppose yeah, it definitely, varies definitely. rin talaga. Oh, naman. But yeah, just to be clear from me on my side, I, I stayed in for Valentine's. Yeah. So we chilled. So we good. But yeah, I mean, I am a fan of it. Because at the end of the day, sharing love is a fucking vibe. But at the same time, like technically speaking, logistically, it's kind of stressful yeah. to be part of the whole thing. Well, last Valentine's <laughs> was not only a Friday, not only a payday. Mm. Add to that it being a holiday so traffic was horrendous yeah, i mean yeah. manila traffic is always horrendous but you know what i mean all the more but last yeah. friday yeah For every valentine's no man kai tuesday pa yeah well, that's true but do you, like i have a question random question do you all feel giddy when february 14 drops like nowadays like no no not anymore no no, no. before it kind of did right before yeah. yeah when we were younger yeah jeez what's the insight on that though we, we, we're grown we as people, man. Yeah. Maybe okay. we've gotten over the, the cheesy aspect of it. Well, Parang yung first, for, for me, siguro, first, yeah. First mo ma-feel yung feelings, you know? Parang, I hear you. I hear you. Ako. Yeah. Ngayon, parang, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Makes sense. It's this person I like. So, are you trying to tell me, bro? Like, if you're dating someone, <laughs> the only good part's the first phase of the relationship? Oof. No, bro. <laughs> okay. I, I just want to <laughs> clear this up. Yes, right? yes, please do. Please to, do. E- to everyone listening. For me, parang yung first part, yung sasabi natin honeymoon phase. Oh, we'll yes, talk about mm-hmm. that. Yes, mm-hmm. it's nice. Pero alam mo yung comfort and alam mo yung may uuwian ka. Ooh. Okay. 
that's the best thing about the relationship. Na parang okay, no matter what happens, someone someone's got your back no matter what. Someone like you could call someone say your person. Yeah. That yeah. person to you is like home. Tapos pwede mong sabihin kahit ano. I mean, yun yung mas for me ah. Kahit walang ha- honeymoon phase pero kung mangyari yun, kung mag-click kayo. That's I mean, that's that good yeah. good. I mean that should be the goal, right? I think it's it's really also very relative to the person. I mean, mm. if Fonz is the type of person who wants What? that kind of <laughs> relationship, yeah. you know, and we don't we just all wish that we would be lucky to meet someone who can give us that na for them it's not kulang or it's not sobra, meaning it's what they're looking for also, diba? Right? Mm. I mean, That's that's the goal, isn't it? You know, to just yeah, pero, meet someone who can just give that to you. Kaya nga sometimes you, you really have to be lucky with love, eh. Kasi you don't always meet people na magkiklik kayo. Yeah, I mean you would Quotable. never know. <laughs> oh nai, you know the coach na. You would, you oh, would God, never God. know what love is okay. if you've what? never experienced what real love is. Oh, <laughs> oh my. so can you say that? You can't express love when you haven't. Received love. Oh, that's true. Oh, so, I have you, you experienced it? Here. Have you experienced it? Yes. I mean, our parents fucking loved us, so I suppose for Hell us to yeah. reciprocate that Pero, would be you natural. Know, I think now not everyone, as in couples, married couples, have felt like true love. Di naman ayaw mm. sabi ng true love, pero, pero parang authentic. How do you mean by that? Real. Like real love. Na parang alam mong You would give up everything for someone, or but the parang high standard cheesy stuff. Hindi yung hindi hindi siya yung parang mali mali sinabi ko. <laughs> okay, you got <laughs> it. You got it. Hindi yung parang superficial na oh I give you flowers, I give you chocolates. Mm. Alam mo yun or parang post it on social that. media. Yeah. It's more about having that understanding na kahit anong mangyare, I got you. Mm, okay. I got you. Okay. How about you, Bay? Like, what's yeah. what's your take on real love? Real love. Woo! I feel I'm like tough. I feel like there's so many ways to answer that question. Hella. Wait, anong classing love to? As in between couples? Between yes. Yeah, so let's let's specify between couples, like romantic oh, love. Romantic. There yeah. You go. What Erotica. exactly is the question again? Like, huh. what's your take on, like? What's your definition of real love? Like, what's that for you when it comes to like in the context of romantic in a romantic relationship? The first, the one of the the first things that pop into my head mm-hmm. upon you asking me that question, because I feel like also at this point in my life, in my dating life now, um, it has a lot to do with yeah. understanding yeah. each other. Um, mm-hmm. Because For me For example To illustrate I'm dating you And um, yeah. To for, for, for you yeah. to, I feel like One of the ways I can truly express My love to you Is To let you know How much I understand you How mm. much How much I understand what you're going through and the things you do and how you feel about these things. Mm. You know, it's it's a it's a very encompassing idea. But I, because f- I feel like I would want to be understood also. Parang um, regardless of what um, I'm going through. For example, we're dating mm-hmm. and then I get mad at you. Before you get mad at me, also I hope you understand me first why I'm mad. Yeah, I hear you. I Parang hear you. ganon. Um, because. Mm-hmm. You know, not definitely me. I'm not the type of person who would just get mad man out of nowhere. I mm-hmm. I would always like to think that when I'm mad, it's justified and mm-hmm. that there's reason for me to be angry. So yeah. I would hope that before you he give me your side, is that you would just hear mine out first, so you'd understand where I'm coming from. Bago mo ako labanan or You know, attack with words. Then, yeah, sure. if it was in a fight, sure. parang ganon. Nabila gugutan ka babi. Meron, Ooh. meron naman. No, no, no but that is some real shit though. We meron, are. No, we meron, are. meron. Pero yeah, yeah, yeah. nga, um, it's. I feel like it's about understanding each other. Um, because it's it's very simple, and I feel like with it, 
it's 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 very basic, but I don't think a lot of people truly know mm. the art of how it is to really understand someone and you know not judge them for it. Yeah, like say building empathy towards your partner. Yeah, because right? it's not you know you have to understand it's not it's sometimes not all about you. For some yeah. th- sometimes because but it's, you you just can't understand another person. Eh. But no, I just that's a real shit too. You can't fall in love. You can't be in love with every person you meet. Yeah, yeah. So parang madaming trial trial and error. Yan. I believe in people not just vibing. People, kahit naging kayo for like three years, kung hindi talaga kayo nagmatch, it's not yeah. gonna work. Eh. Yeah, no, that's you true. Know? I I think when when I answered the understanding part. Oh, for me, I feel like there's an effort for me to understand you because I yeah. know that there's something solid under that. Meaning, mm. alam ko na na this is exactly why I want to understand you more because I, meron tayong something and I don't want to waste that. That's why I'm working on progressing I, with you. I want to know what this something is. Like, what's that something that would propel you to just work on a certain relationship, on a certain connection? Or maybe... Wait, that's the thing. Before you answer that, may sabihin ulit ako. Okay, okay. okay. So for me, kunwari, ganun, parang meron kang issue with that person. Parang kasi ako, pag pumipili ako ng winaway ko if I should be with this person or not, iniisip ko lagi, is there something about this person na hindi ko kaya i-carry on with my life? Parang kunwari, if this person is too shallow, can I live okay. with that? <laughs> Where's this coming from, Bonzi? No, no, kasi as in ganito yung like idea ko of love. Yeah, I hear you. For a while na, na parang if there's something na parang oh, kailangan ko i-compromise, kailangan mm. ko parang i-work on, tapos gusto mo baguhin yung other person, to me, hindi na kayo bagay. Parang just what? stop that. Kasi you can just find someone else na magva-vibe ka. Wag mo nang pilitin. If alam mo talaga in your heart na oh this is not gonna work out because this is something na ayoko talaga about this well, person. I, you know? I, siguro you for know? him to say na if gut feeling mo talaga na yeah. it's not gonna work out. Meaning, Hindi naman gut feel. Or like if you, well you said kasi if you know it in your heart that it's not gonna work out. Yeah, heart feel. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. sorry. Heart feel. Heart feel. I like that. <laughs> sorry. Heart feel. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Sorry. No, but yun nga. I I think for you to say na if you know it in your heart na you're mm. not meant or right for this person, then I agree with you na wag mo nang ipilit kasi mm. I think no one wants that kind of feeling na oh yeah. you're only you only you're only choosing to stay with this person even if you know it doesn't feel right kasi bi- literally pinagpipilitan mo yung yeah. sarili mo to someone who like what does can't even reciprocate or communicate with you on that level na you want to be yeah you know, kasi yeah. like madaming tao na they stay in a relationship kasi alam mo yun parang lagi na hindi magbabago yan yan mga ganyan or mm. oh she made the mistake I can forgive her or alam mo yun parang it's what's go- comfortable or or like sasabihin oh I just need time parang to change kunwari lasinggero parang oh lasinggero siya pero I like him I'll just overlook is that, that. like oh. this, like the savior savior's complex type of shit from like a person you know how, how they say that yeah, shit when you, when you wanna fix ah, something yeah, yeah. There, some people are like that right yeah pero yun nga yung mali para sa akin kung hindi kayo nag click hindi kayo nag vibe stop it I have a question though because you did touch on it because you mentioned compromise because yes. for me if you are in a real relationship if it's always going to be a part of it yeah, yeah compromise is quite integral yeah. to it but at the same time I like what the you amount. like what you mentioned bro yeah. if it's yung yung heart feel na yan bro oh yung heart feel. yung heart feel na yan hindi pala sa gut sa heart sa heart bro walang feelings yan okay 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 i suppose yeah definitely you can't it's hard for you to compromise if your heart feel if your heart feel is i know not inclined towards that person because if you feel like wala na like i'm not sold to this relationship so i won't waste my time and compromise this because i don't think we'll just like continue on but at the same time what i'm trying to say is just Compromise though is important. important. Yeah. Yeah. Like especially if you're with like 
the one you really want to be with. Yeah. Because no relationship is perfect. For sure. Sa akin kasi, uh, oh, sige na lang. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 go okay, ahead. Go ahead. Kasi, pagdating sa relationships, ayoko ng compromises. Ayoko yung parang, no, no, no. It's so crazy. Kasi, yeah. ano, let's say, ito yung ibig sabihin ng compromise. Okay. I give you something, pero, I expect nothing back. That's not no. no. Yes. That's more of like unconditional. Yeah. Hindi paano ba explain ang compromise? Okay, kayo. <laughs> explain compromise. You want to go with yours, bae? Compromise. Parang kunwari, pupunta ako sa states, tapos sabihin tapos sabihin ko, ah, sige, okay lang, let's compromise. Parang okay lang, together pa rin kayo, pero to make the sh- the shit work, okay lang, parang ganoon. Ang hirap mag-isip. On the uh, spot. Si- simple analogy type there of shit. There you go. Go. Um, let's say uh, the girls from the south, you're from the north, meet in the middle. That's a compromise. That's compromise. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like meet that. Because that's compromise. Yeah. For me, Indian compromise. Golly. How is how is that? No, because it's compromise? just effort. Just meet in the middle. Ano yung compromise? Wala namang na comp. Because pag sinabi mong compromise, it means parang you're helping the other person. To your expense. I'ma whip out Webster's. <laughs> Gets mo ba? Na parang kunwari, No, I hear you though. No, no, compromise. Okay. Kunwari, may phone mo Pero to. Pero tama I, naman I yun din yung sinabi niya na oh, I, north and south. Eh, hindi yun dapat compromise. Like, effort. Conscious effort, effort yun. Pero, Siguro pertaining to that example. Mm. No, ito, ito. Ito yung example ko. Okay, kunwari, okay. I, okay. You have, this is your phone. Okay. Tapos, I need this phone. Kasi, may kailangan tawagan. You have to give me this phone. You have to compromise for me. Gets mo ba? That's what compromise is. Gets? Oh. Read. Ah, 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 ah. Read. <laughs> it, According it, to Article 17. Yes, sir. So compromise. Compromise is an agreement or a settlement of a dispute that is reached by each side making concessions. So it's an ability to listen to two sides in a dispute and devise a compromise acceptable to both. <laughs> acceptable uh, to both. Like, mm. creating a solution that'd be beneficial for both in a way. Compromise. Basically, meeting halfway. Compromise. Oh, we got to fight, boy. I'm <laughs> not playing, bro. Ano pa yung ba? Compromise uh, kasi, kasi yung law. Baka yung compromise yung kasi, I feel law. like from, from, the, from the definition, it it's... It's a mutual thing. Yes. And siguro more of this was like, if someone's gonna sacrifice for me, I don't wanna do it. Uh, yeah. Yun okay. yung sinasabi niya kanina. Sinasabi ko na parang, Yo, Bae's like, yo. Okay, eto. I'm, 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 I'm yeah. mediator. Eto yung, madi- eto yung <laughs> example. Bro. Kunwari, nag-iyosi ka. Kunwari, smoker ka. Oh yeah, that, I think Tapos, that's a compromise. you have to quit smoking to be with this person. Yan yung compromise na sinasabi ko. Now you have to give up yourself for the other person. Yeah. For me, Okay. Mali yun. Because for me, to be in love with someone, you have to be yourself. You have to give, you have to give yourself. Eh. you have to be, be who you are. Yeah. Meaning, you also just want them to just accept you, like take it or leave it. Yes. Mm. There you go. Okay. Take it or leave it. Yeah. If you don't like me, don't you're date me. Poison. That's the context you're of new, your compromise. Yeah, which is Got different. Yeah. I was about to throw hands, bro. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. But yeah, that was, no, that was that was uh, no, that delete, was a good delete, dialogue delete. though. But that was nice. Compromise. We that. But yeah, okay. I mean, now we're in that topic of love and whatnot. Like, I love you. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> love you too, boy. So, I mean, like what we mentioned earlier, love is quite. It's it's one hell of a spectrum. So it's one he- hell of a topic to just like cover. Love is a spectrum. Yeah, I mean. Damn it, when I go, it's right. What's oh, okay. what? Like, <laughs> just a general question because I haven't thought of any yet. Like, what? What's one thing about love that you guys just feel like? I don't know something that that's not clear with you yet or some shit in the context of like being romantically linked with someone. As a romance. Yeah. What about it? That's not like, like when you're dating someone, like. Like Dimo gets, yeah. Wait, I'm I'm a bit vague on this, but at the same time, what you talking about? Willis? That that context, like, what's a specific situation? Na parang nalalabuan ka na parang yeah. Why is this hmm. happening with this relationship? Ganon. Yeah. <gasps> Do y'all think? 
Y'all got a specific <laughs> no. situation. That's so deep. <laughs> y'all got a specific Both. situation where y'all feel like. Well, well. This isn't parang, built out of love. Oh, I think um, it. One thing that pops into my head mm-hmm. is siguro something with uh, boundaries. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. It can be. It can be tricky. It it it's a it can be like a touchy subject Super also. Soap. Yeah. Are you talking about labels? But they're in bond. I guess they're mm. in a way. I guess they're in a way interconnected or intertwined mm. with each other. Mm-hmm. But but then how to get labels? Sure, I don't. Yeah, this is the topic. Yeah, yeah. Labels. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm good with that. I'm good with that. Cause in a way, some people are. Be, oh. alam ko si B kailangan niya nung kailangan oh. niya yung topic na to me? kasi may dinitin I know ba you tell us ba me? like what's the label what's the label about like I don't know well, for millennials is it still a problem for Gen oh, Z's yeah well, what's the move what's the move what's the know, proper move na natin eh. probably, for them, probably for them probably for them it's not as it's not as uh, difficult for them to actually put a label on something or for it to be just casually whatever they want it to be yeah. Because they didn't have to go. Th- wala naman silang. May phone parang, na kasi wala na silang experience ng traditional courting. na courting, mm. legal na tinata ng pa will you be my girlfriend? Will you be my boyfriend? O wala na wala na silang ganon. Na I feel like the notion, <laughs> or I don't think yeah. it's I the don't think the spirit of it. Yeah, parang it's it's very different, I guess, for them now, but. Yeah, I feel like it s- still should be important, but uh, but then again, it's a uh, it has to be obviously a mutual understanding. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a ju- yeah, Fonzie, were you about to say something? Because I was about to share something. <laughs> Feeling ko ngayon madali lang mag-ask ng oh, will you be my girlfriend? Or boyfriend. No, because it's yeah, that, yeah, because it's either you want them to be your girlfriend or not. Eh. Either you want her so much to be your girlfriend that it prompts you to ask, or okay, ka lang nag- hindi kayo officially together and you don't ask. At all, this is a better question. Okay, go ahead. Because yung yung question na will you be my girlfriend? Parang mas mas heavy na yung answer mo when you grow older. Because kapag mm. teenager ka or like early twenties, parang Parang oh, temporary no, lang lahat yeah, that's eh. true. Parang, oh, I can date you and then date another person next time. Pero kung 28 ka na, 30 ka na, oh, yeah. oh, when you ask real. that question, parang, yeah, 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 yeah. parang borderline, will you marry me na yun eh? I have a real question, love. Yeah. Um, for, for you specific, for women, on the women's POV. Okay. Like, when y'all hit a certain age, like say mid-20s, like we're all in our mid twenties now. But that was a bay. Yeah. Bay's know. like twenty one, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we're mid twenties. Okay. But yeah, go. um is there a certain age where y'all feel like, man, I feel pressured to just like get wed or be with someone already? I think um the She's too young to feel There's it. there's also <laughs> there's also uh one of the reasons, Siguru, why you why maybe guys think that for girls there is that pressure has also a lot to do with the fact that technically the the relationship, the seriousness, the serious aspect of having the relationship that eventually leads to, let's say what, marriage, mm-hmm. ganyan, which then leads to family. So for the girl to have that kind of pressure, kasi it, it's a chain of thoughts, it's like a domino effect kind of thing. Na parang oh, okay. The there's obviously pressure to answer your question. Yes, because mm. um, let's say if the girl also wants to have a family, there's also kasi that danger of going through pregnancy at a later age. Mm. Hence that yes. kind of pressure. You like you have to consider the biological. Clock yeah, of hindi the women. yung hindi yung relationship yeah, yeah. lang hindi yung tayo na ba mm-hmm. uh, pa- engaged shit. na ba tayo mm-hmm. soon. It's it it. I hope guys know na girls being uh, wanting seriousness out of a relationship only just stems from the fact that technically, I don't think anyone would just like to 
keep wasting each other's time, you know. And yeah, there's, all there's, I want to do is waste your time. There's 2020. <laughs> Please, let's change that. Let's change that. No, yeah, no I'm all for that. that. No, I'm all for no. that. No, I'm, I'm, I no want to that. people to waste each, each other's time. <laughs> the hell? It should. Well, it's okay. A, let's lie. just say that <laughs> if you were again, if we were dating and I were to waste your time. Mm-hmm. I would let you know I'm wasting your time. Yes, there you I go. I would actually appreciate that. There you go. Exactly. I would actually appreciate just that. Just be mature about yeah. it. No, real talk. Real yeah. talk. Be sweet about it. No, just actually be yeah. honest and be a Yun decent nga, person. Exactly. God nah, damn. If, I don't want to waste your time. Nah, nah. Yeah. Like, gusto ko, like, I just need t- someone to hang out with for the next two months. Can that be you? Mm. Diba? Yeah. Something Guys, like that. DM. Something would you like actually that. appreciate <laughs> that if like a boy would like come up to you and be like to be honest Dependent. at the onset at the onset chamber to girls that's like what the fuck but yeah also pretty worth more is this my exactly part? exactly that's that's exactly that's but do. also that comes with the perspective of the girl because if you ask me if i were to be told that uh, by a guy mm-hmm. ang onset kong may isip is no, oh, syempre, i would be like Nakakabastos din yon. But also, yeah. if you think about it from like a glass half full kind of perspective, at least he was upfront and honest about it. Meaning, hindi na niya ako pina ikot ikot. Hindi mm. na niya ako pina lead on na, oh, I want more from you. Like, yeah. I just want. Birth. Like, I'm, I'm gonna be here on vacation for two months. I just mm. need someone. Can that be you? If not, then just leave. Or like, kasi sa nga, mag, you lead them on to something that you're not even ready for. Mm. Maybe it's just like that shit. lang. Yeah. That's some real shit. Killing. So it's also it's coming uh, then from how the girl will see it. There's a there's a bad and a good side to it. You just have to be aware enough to see and realize both. Yeah. Self awareness is key. Yes, my hella, friends. hella. Self awareness. I've been telling this to all of my office mates lately. Yeah. For example, I have this I have this teammate mm-hmm. uh, who is in an LDR and then Oof. when they would for example be in a fight and she would tell me about it, I would make her realize how she's wrong in the situation. And then I tell her that, you know, it's it's not a bad thing because then you become so self aware that the next time it happens, it doesn't lead to that anymore because you mm. have the the awareness to stop yourself from actually being what? unreasonable or that's real hot-headed or impatient or not understanding yeah you know that's real yeah i mean the end of the day we all have to acknowledge our bullshit yeah like self-awareness is key friends yes ma'am definitely that should be my on everything, on everything. <laughs> yo why not right i mean no, but that's really important people should know about recently that recently super not internalized and i'm like Thank it's not God. easy to i uh, know i realize if you like yeah. it's easy to just like say but at the same time, just to like fully grasp it yeah. is one thing. Know thyself. The best of man, Benson. Check okay, yourself. holy boy. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. We good? Yeah. Yeah, lo- um, lovely. So we actually tackled a lot of topics for today's episode. Yeah, about love, Valentine's, compromise. Let's close <laughs> it out with some lovely thoughts, good energy from each one. <laughs> Let's do that, yeah? Fonzie, want to start off with some closing thoughts? My closing thoughts? Thought. Thought. Uh, love every day. Amen. Damn, that's profound, my boy. Bay. Ah, how do <laughs> my I last even, words. How do I even top that? Well, uh, love I, every I day. I mean, Bay, I, I wouldn't take it against you if you didn't. Because that was well, just like... Well, <laughs> yeah, nga, pero, but yeah, love. You know, just... How do I top that? Maybe something with so with something basic also like in the lines know of Know your worth. Oh always be <laughs> kind na lang. Because it's a know your worth. Pero pwede din. Know your worth. Could be. Everyone's worth. No. Yeah. Self awareness I mean, na lang. Ooh, there. yun na lang. Last, last I, I, point, I feel yeah, like I feel intriguing. like if you guys were to ask me what one main takeaway I na you for example your listeners would want to grasp from me maybe one of that is self-awareness we didn't get to really dwell much on that topic yeah. but i guess it's a skill that i hope a lot of people get the master because not only will it be for themselves but also it will also help them in how they deal with other people and how they react to certain things and it's 
doesn't ne- it doesn't necessarily have to be you know related to relationships that's real not just romantic you know oh. it can also be applied to everyday life in the most mundane of things then know so. what you like know what you hate yeah yeah i suppose just to like double down to what y'all mentioned yeah from maybe i could just say i mean start with just loving yourself yeah you know what i mean self-awareness is part of that for sure we got outro song but i know yeah because you won't be able you, you won't be able to like share love to others if there's none within you yeah you know what i mean so yeah let's share that love people yeah thank you bay for being the thank first you, oh ever God. visitor guest yes lovely Can't this believe is that actually happened. historical yes ma'am we did it yeah, we did it thank well yeah thank you. you guys for tuning in for first episode for 2020 convos in Convos in the Attic is finally back. So yeah, thank you guys for Yay. tuning in. Um, please do give us a follow on our IG. Spotify uploads will be up soon. And yeah, thank you guys. Thank you. Yay. I would love to be back. Yes, you will. Should you have me back. Next episode. <laughs> Bukas. <laughs> Bukas. <laughs> Thanks guys. See you.